Hello everybody, got my camouflage t-shirt on. Today's video we're going to have a look at the Rough Rider Mini Canoe. This purchase was inspired by me coming across the case Mini Butterbean online and thinking that's a rather nice little knife. And I thought that would be a rather nice little knife with either white bone or mother of pearl handles. I haven't seen such a knife on sale in the UK but I did happen across this little Rough Rider and I thought that the Rough Rider would make a good substitute. Obviously it's not going to be the same quality as the Case Mini Butterbean but it's similar in style, similar in size and crucially probably only a tenth of the price. So let's have a look. Okay, so this is how the knife comes in the brown Rough Rider box. And the model number is RR055. Mini canoe. So we have the knife in the little Johnny bag, as normal. And this is it. We've got standard traditional pattern construction on this canoe. Two back springs, two brass liners, nickel silver bolsters with a engraved or cut line detail, white bone scales, three brass pins, two blades, a small pen blade, And a larger. These are quite highly polished so they do pick up the fingerprints. It's quite a small knife. If we measure the handle length is about 68 millimeters, two and three quarter inches. The small blade tip to bolster about an inch and three quarters 36 mil and the larger blade is about 48 mil oh, hang on that says an inch and three quarters so go back to this one an inch and three eighths it's more like it isn't it so the standard size comparison would be with the Victorinox Spartan copy. As you can see this knife is quite a bit smaller. We could also compare it to the regular size Rough Rider canoe which is about 92mm closed. and has a much more substantial blade. The only significant difference between the two apart from the size is the smaller mini canoe has a straight nail pull whereas the larger or regular size has the crescent shaped nail pull. The details are all as you would expect on Rough Rider on the small blade we have the horseshoe emblem stamped on the tang. On the larger blade we have the horseshoe emblem stamped on the tang on one side. On the other side on the blade itself. The model number RR05 China. And then here 440 razor sharp steel. So if we get the scales out and see what this knife weighs. So in grams, that's 39.6 compared to the standard size of 75.3 and in English that's 1.4 ounces for the mini compared to 2.65 for the regular. 
The fit and finish on this knife is quite good for the price. Bear in mind this only costs £8. All the joints are smooth, all the pins are flush and polished. There is just a very slight gap between the liner and the spring there and the liner and the spring there. And that's it really. For £8 sterling, it's a lovely little thing. Let's try the factory edge. We'll start off with the catalogue paper. Small blade. It cuts, it's sharp, but you can feel it's toothy. And the larger blade. Very similar. It's sharp and it cuts cleanly, but you can feel it and you can hear it. So it's not the most refined factory edge, but it is functional. Let's see how we get on with the um, phone book paper. And we're struggling there. You can see and you can hear the blade chattering as it cuts through. So this one definitely does need a bit of a strop. Having said that, that level of sharpness is probably perfectly acceptable to regular non-knife nuts. And it won't take much work either to bring that up to a, a proper edge. So that's it for the um, Rough Rider Mini Canoe. Very simple knife, not a great deal to say, but well made for the price. Good pocket sized knife for the UK um, with our fairly strict limitations on what you can and can't carry. And it's a good practical size. One more size comparison, I think. Case Peanut. It's very much in the same ballpark for length. A couple of millimetres, maybe a quarter of an inch shorter than the Peanut. A little bit more robust all round though, in terms of outside dimensions. So, there we have the Rough Rider Mini Canoe. RR055. A lovely little knife, I think. And well worth eight quid. Thanks for watching.